Who's a reporter for reproductive and developmental biology? He's coming. Okay, so let's skip over that because I know Lynn is ready for um, host microbial vector biology. <laughs> So we have a couple of big uh, item points. We may take a lot of notes, but um, so some big ideas: fostering interdisciplinary interaction and data sharing with training for data scientists. And actually, I would add to that training for genomicists as well. It's a two-way street. Uh, focusing on intersecting and connecting research projects currently focused on different scales uh, and, uh, and in different silos as well. Um, example, host to pathogen to microbiome to environment. So identifying those uh, opportunities to connect across disciplines and across um, even types of institutes that we all work for or, or with. Um, third, added value opportunities. We love that, um, um, as we were coining it. Um, um, these are projects, really. So you're supporting um, ideas uh, where there's potentially higher risk, but it's cross-disciplinary project. So um, say you're getting funded for a particular project, have one piece and component of that project where it's outside of your box, outside your comfort zone. It, it identifies a new collaboration, a new consortium, um, a new area of interest that you have a, a set partner to work with, potentially, um, to actually advance these cross-reaching uh, opportunities. And again, uh, for those as well, postdoctoral opportunities uh, on products you already have, identifying at least one postdoctoral person in your group to do some of these outside the box ideas. And lastly, capturing the breadth of information. So we capture change over time, um, response to new pathogens, capture the background state as well as when something exciting happens. Um, this is also brought up in, in the pathogen idea that uh, we want to look at these um, environmental ac activities, things going on before they become pathogens, before there's an outbreak, to have that context. And we had a great team up on the, on the panel, so thank you, everyone. <laughs>